If you look around you, everything that you see in the world had to be designed, it had to be created and fabricated. Our software really helps people experience their designs as if they're real, as if they're built and operating. From architecture, engineering and construction, to manufacturing, infrastructure, all of the stuff that you see in the entertainment industry, with film, media or audiovisual. What's happening now is you're getting a Cambrian explosion of computing platform. Having new interface systems, paradigms, is going to be key. We don't live in a flat screen in the real world, we live in full space. How can we bring that into some of our design software? What we did with our plugin is we hooked up the entire Leap SDK and wrapped it in Maya, meaning that you can quite quickly script up very customized applications inside of Maya that directly interact with the Leap. Once I saw some of the accuracy of the device, that got really interesting because now we've got a very inexpensive device that you can do all sorts of new things with in true 3D space. I model in Maya. Happy Feet, Spider-Man, Transformers, Nike commercials, Super Bowl commercials, all kinds of stuff. When I found out that you could track all your fingers, that's pretty amazing. You actually have more control. When you start using it, you quickly realize how sensitive it is. Things that you're thinking in your mind can happen so much faster. It was really about doing things that you could never do with a mouse. So being able to grab something like an engine and disassemble it and reassemble it. To do that with a mouse, you'd have to constantly change your view. You'd have to constantly manipulate the objects around. With the Leap, this was one of the first prototypes we built. We found really fast that you could just reach in and grab and pull something apart, put it back together really cognitively, much like you do in the real world. Eventually, if we have true 3D spatial interaction, the line is blurred. The world becomes your interface and your display.